Welcome everyone to this gorgeous, terrific Thursday. And let's see what our nature angels wish to tell us. Yes, they are whispering and chirping away in this wonderful space at Just Be, while the little water fountain trickles behind me and these wonderful flowers are all alive and smiling at us. And yes, we have some human activity outside as well. We shall ask the angels to help us speak louder. <laughs> okay, so let's see what the angels wish to tell us on this gorgeous day. Angels, please keep the traffic in control outside the gates. The angels tell us and remind us this underlying truth of our lives. God or divinity is not what is giving you any pain. The pain is self-created and inflicted by humanity through its own doings or misdoings of habitual patterns over lifetimes. We are here to help you move away from all that pain towards love and peace. Know that God is all loving. The angels ask us, to release old unwanted habits and create new positive ones. The angels ask us to pray to them that may our new habits be supported in all ways that are positive and that we are helped to remain all good and God loving. We often tend to curse life or curse God at times or fight with God and divinity. Why are you doing this? Why such a good person has to suffer this? Why this one has to do that? Why I have to go through this? But the angels remind us that it is we who have created this self-inflicted suffering upon us. It is we as humans through our doings and misdoings of our karma have accumulated all these patterns which have turned into actions and that which are bringing in the cycle of all that we are experiencing. And this life and every incarnation goes on in that circle of expressing a thought, word and deed and thereby experiencing another thought, word and deed in equivalent intensity. And the angels tell us that only when we release old unwanted habits and create new positive ones will we be able to snap out of this circle, this vicious circle of our old karmic patterns. So pray to your angels and invoke God's love to help you to be integral, to be honest, to be loving, to be kind, to be compassionate. All these things don't cost a dime. They are free. But it is we who do not utilize it. It is we who do not pay attention to them because we just take them for granted. We think they just exist, but they don't. They are our very existence. So when we shift our focus and attention to these positive habits and patterns, we shall be able to undo many and unwanted karmic patterns and things in our lives. The angels remind us again to just know that God is only and only all loving and that there is nothing that God does to ever and ever punish us. It is our own karma that is punishing us, that is bringing us those events and circumstances which... We'll wait for a second. Which we have to go through. And once we realize that, then we shall stop fighting and rather utilize that constructive time to love God and seek His love and grace in all that we think, speak and do. With that, we move on to the color of the day. And today's color is the beautiful light blue for the throat chakra. So work with the light blue and cleanse and clear your throat chakra so that you can express your little self into the world. Be honest with your feelings and emotions, honor them, and if there is anything that you ever want to speak to a loved one, then please take care, love yourself first, and ask your angels to help you to speak it out to that loved one. Whatever that you wish to express, always pray that may you express it in the one light and one love of God. 
and may the other person also receive it in the one light and one love of God. So that you are not misunderstood, so that people do not think that you mean otherwise. And all that you say is taken in that best spirit of life and love of God. With that, we leave you with being the most brilliant creative expression of life. Stay blessed, loved, and protected. In love and light and the pink of God's speed.